plan. We have to fight discrimination in our own land. We cannot agree for outsiders to come to our land and discriminate against us with the connivance of anybody. Anybody helping them, and then they say, We are not, we don't, we don't, we don't from supermarket. Ah, I've been on this supermarket now. Wait, ah. <laughs> Make it look good, this supermarket. Now go pay me. Oh. Make it look good, this supermarket. Oh. Let's not liberate just super one supermarket. I want to tell you all the places Europeans have blocked you from. The foreigners have blocked you from your own country that you cannot enter. Mm -hmm. So that you can be ready to enter there. Since we are ready to fight discrimination. Except as I said, that, that lie that they always that that, that lie that they always like that lie that they like that. That lie that they always like lie that they lie again. <laughs> uh. But before I start, I pen down some little things what I want to talk about. You know, before we push into the white privilege issue. Anytime I look internet, AZ talks about the SD, and I have to ask you people, you educated professionals, graduates, master degree holders, uh, PhD holders of Nigeria, why they say anytime when they show somebody online, we just day by itself build car, day by itself build something, just arrange car where they move, just build one kind of thing, or make one kind of television, or make one kind of radio. Any kind of way show that kind of thing for social media, it will be one kind of small picking or a uh, illiterate when you go to university. Why be saying that uneducated Nigerians when they for street they build things? What's happening? As <laughs> they asked me this thing yesterday, so what did they teach you that inside that that school? <laughs> when we say that boys when they for street they build car. They, they think they have to repair. Okay. If they don't, if they will ask the question, don't give me the answer. Say, they only teach people how to repair. <coughs> Inside that, that school, now how to repair, they, they teach you that. Because it's only outside. On the streets, I see people try to build something. <coughs> I see people try to build something. They go build car. And I'm not going to see them. will not be saying when they build the car finish. Because you say all the, for that their state, the engineering faculty go gather their best students, their professor, they go carry that person, give them honorary uh, admission. You say this is a genius. Carry and enter their middle. I bet teach us how you do this thing. You say we there will be mumu. No, mm. teach us. No, we just do and make it work well. They will say no, make I go buy innocent. Say innocent is Nigerian made car. Innocent is an assembly plant. We've had those in Nigeria. Volkswagen, we get assembly plant. Innocent gets his license from Nissan. Nigeria does not manufacture steel. We don't manufacture bolts and screws. How dare you say you have a made in Nigeria car? You have a car assembled in Nigeria. It's made in Japan. It won't be a FMA car. It's really refining you cannot feed yourself in your country. You are not you can't make enough food to eat. You can't even refine the crude oil that is in your ground. You have to go and call the countries of this world to donate to one billionaire. Oh, national, it was a global effort for one billionaire to build one refinery that we can't even see the impact in our life. Should Nigeria have one functioning refinery? Our government will be under military rule. Four refineries were built in this country. None of them can work. Engineer, petrochemical engineering students are graduating by their thousands every year. Early taking the final is she You that you people in the in the field. Instead, make on a fight, make on a field work. I keep telling Nigerians, it is if to say fella carrying Afrobeat music as government hate out, fella packing bag and packages. Go stay for America. Will you people have this gift that he left here? The way Nigerian professionals think, 
it is the best of us when we see that our country doesn't match our potential now we suppose